One condition that can cause chronic visual loss that you cannot afford to miss is chronic open-angle glaucoma. If chronic open-angle glaucoma is missed, your patient can go blind. Unlike patients with angle closure glaucoma who classically present with a painful red eye with nausea and vomiting, patients with open-angle glaucoma are asymptomatic. This is a very common condition which affects nearly 3% of the population. Patients with chronic open-angle glaucoma develop high pressures in the eye when the drainage system in the eye, known as the trabecular meshwork, degenerates and becomes obstructed. As the disease progresses, patients may develop peripheral visual loss on visual field testing and, at its end stage, central vision can also be lost. Unfortunately, 50% of patients have advanced disease at the time of diagnosis. This is why it is so critical for at-risk patients to be screened every one to two years. To be considered at-risk, patients would need to have more than one of the following risk factors. Age over 80, being nearsighted, having high blood pressure and diabetes, having a positive family history, and those of African-American ancestry. Clinical signs of open-angle glaucoma include a cup-to-disc ratio greater than 0.5, cup-disc asymmetry between the two eyes, the presence of a disc hemorrhage, and an eye pressure that is greater than 21 millimeters of mercury. Because of its high prevalence, it is important that even those that are not at risk but are over the age of 45 be periodically screened for glaucoma typically every two to four years. At age 65 and older, all patients should have annual eye assessments to screen for glaucoma and other eye diseases.